Let's talk Pokemon Yellow for Game Boy. I have noticed that the intro to Pokemon Yellow from five years ago has been watched quite a lot recently. And so I thought I'd add this addition. Not only is Pokemon Yellow a great game, which you can complete without catching all 150 Pokemon, but it also links to its partners, red and blue. It's a brilliant intro. We're just going to turn the volume down here, which outlines this transfer cable, where you could connect to another Game Boy, whether it be Pocket, Color or Classic. Or you could use the infrared on the top to transfer Pokemon from one edition to the other. The strategy game guide for the game that came out late 90s as well. I purchased this from Toys R Us along with the game and I have used this to be able to find helpful hints and tips like most strategy guides for games. But the other thing it really helped was outlining which Pokemon would be available in which edition of the Game Boy game and what potions you could pick up and use with the Pokemon. The levels that they evolved at, the bosses that you may battle, or gym leaders as they were called, until you met the elite. So, 150 Pokemon. Who was not in the original game? Well, that's very easy to find out. We go to the 150 of Pokemon, which Somewhere around here, we discover was Mewtwo. So you cannot get a Mew in the original game. Mewtwo was found in the Unknown Dungeon on all versions, red, blue and yellow. Red and blue obviously came out before yellow because yellow was the special Pikachu edition. Very popular at the time. We also had our checklists, so you could tick off who you had collected, who you had evolved and who you transferred. And then, of course, there was the training game, which we'll come to in a future video. This magazine also came with a full pull-out poster of the entire map from the game, which I hope to find one day and involve in a future video as well. For now, I hope you have enjoyed this short video and see you next time.